Tobbs? Tobbs? Deke sent me. Are you in here? Um, where? Oh god. Don't question my methods, cynical. <laughs> I don't like this. Incendio. Ah! Oh my god. doesn't affect Acromantulas like it does the little ones. It's 
stuck in the corner. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay. There's a victory that came none too soon. <laughs> Let's see what I missed. <laughs> uh. Confringo. That table looks familiar. Seems I'm back at the entrance to the cave. I'm back from the cave, Deke. Wonderful. Uh, uh, Deke hopes you gave Deke's best to Tobbs. <sighs> I'm sorry to tell you this, Deke, but Tobbs is gone. It seems he was unable to avoid the spiders in the end. Oh, my. Deke was afraid of this, alone in that cave for so long. Oh, poor Tobbs. Uh, uh, Deke and Tobbs once shared the same master when he died. Uh, we were separated. Deke always wished Tobbs had been sent to Hogwarts, too. Deke feels lucky to serve such kind witches and wizards like you. Deke will miss his friend dearly and will raise the glass to him with a heavy heart. <laughs> I don't mean to be grim, but could Harlow have taken him? Archie's satchel is missing, so he may have left on his own. Hopefully, he's just gone wandering, as he's prone to do. I hope he wasn't here when Harlow... <laughs> ...when my husband... <gasps> Do you know which way Archie might have gone? <laughs> um... He has a little hideout in the forest, south of here. He never wanders far. But if he witnessed Harlow doing something to his father... Uh, ...I'm afraid to leave, in case he comes back home. We'll find your son, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. <laughs> what am I going to do? <laughs> um. Pavelio. What is? Archie's satchel. Why would he leave it behind? He was likely running from Hallow, distracted. This may be a good time for Revelio again. Archie went this way. I love that when you I run, have a they bad run feeling with about you. This. Hallow must Unlike have a reason Skyrim, for pursuing where they Archie. Are the slowest I wonder what Archie saw. World. I hope he didn't see Harlow kill his father. He would never overcome it. <sighs> At least not in any way I can imagine. Wait, Revelio, let's go. Oh. They're so hard to see! <laughs> A fork in the road. We will need Revelio again. Multiple sets of footprints. Oh, Harlow caught up to him here. This is not good. They went this way. <sighs> Has no patience for her allies? Yes, I do! <laughs> Skyrim NPCs get stuck on the staircase if they want to. No. <gasps> A festival. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> no. They are beautiful, are they not? You can see festivals too. I witnessed death when I was nine. Saw my first festival shortly thereafter. I found comfort in it. No! No, I want it. No, I'm sorry no! to experience something like that at so young an age. Uh, I was with my father when he died. My mother was away. There's another one. I felt quite helpless. It was a long time ago in some ways, but in other ways, it seems like it was only yesterday. I still see him so clearly. Yes. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> My father was a wonderful man. <laughs> Let us keep moving. We must find Archie. I did it! Sorry, the Thestral was more important than Archie in that moment. <laughs> That is not true. I just forget about that. <laughs> what you doing? This is a big tent. Expect this tent to be so large on the inside. That complicates things a little. All the coins. Help! Can someone help me? Is anybody there? No. Help! Can someone help me? Is anybody there? Please, I need your help. Archie? Archie Beckham. <laughs> Sorry. How do you know who I am? Your mother sent us to find you. Oh, I'm so glad to see you. Not too loud, Achi. That's a lot less than Sorry. how often I use it. We Thomas. need to get this open. Alohomora. Did anybody find out that Merlin tried? <laughs> that I don't know what to do with? <laughs> We're so sorry, Archie. We won't let him get away with it. But first, we need to get you home to your mother. Thank you for saving me. We wouldn't have it any other way, Archie. Now, let's get you home. We know a safe way no, back. No, I want a spoiler for Oh, Archie, you're here. Oh, oh, you're safe. Mother, oh, mother. Father's friends are in danger. I heard the people who took me talking about them. Which friends, darling? Mr. and Mrs. Raid, Mr. Filbert, and I think they also said Otto's name. Oh, I shall speak with them. You run inside. Yes, Mother. Your husband's friends may be in danger. Just as he was. How can we help? You've done enough. My husband was a powerful wizard and couldn't defeat Harlow. The last thing we need is that monster coming after you. It may be too late for that. I'm okay, afraid that Harlow's already cynical. after us. I just then have you to need find to anger again. him further. I assure you, the threat could be a lot worse. Please, please <coughs> keep your distance. I'm sorry again about your husband, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. And thank you for bringing Archie home. I can never repay the two of you for your kindness. I received your owl. I was able to speak with Lodgok, the goblin I mentioned before. Well, what did you learn? He and Ranrock were close once, but they had a falling out. You believe he can be trusted? Mm. He seemed trustworthy. Difficult to know, really. But Sorona Ryan trusts him. Well, that's something, I suppose. Supposing he can be trusted, will he help us get to Ranrock? I've retrieved a stolen helm that he hopes to return to Ranrock in order to regain his confidence. You have been busy. Let's hope your efforts result in our learning something about Ranrock's plans. Lodgok did mention that Ranrock is searching for something, but he couldn't say what. Perhaps that helm will yield some answers. Ranrock is searching for something? I feared as much. I love the St. Patrick's I've heard hat. an unusual amount of activity. Goblins and wizards, I surmise. When visiting my portrait at my castle. Rookwood Castle? My former residence, <laughs> yes. 
That castle is also Great the location like of the like. last trial. I'm sorry to tell you that Victor Rookwood, evidently your descendant, is a dark wizard in league with Ranrock. My descendant? A <laughs> dark wizard? I I'm literally no said earlier, waste. I'm surprised that Despite the that obstacles they carry away to, you must get to Rookwood Castle immediately. Not only is it the location of the next trial, it is home to a source of power that would be devastating in the wrong hands. I do wish we had the luxury of time. However, I do not doubt your abilities. Find my portrait there as soon as you can. Very well, sir. I'm on my way. Best of luck. No time to waste. I'll meet you at Rookwood Castle. What's going on here? Professor Rookwood was right. The place is crawling with Victor I'm Rookwood's feeling better. and Ranrock's I still sound lawless. stuffy. They're as working a together, all right. But, but it is not a friendly alliance. I don't. I'm sure feel you like agree that we need to find a way in other than the front <laughs> gate. Let's go. If I'd known your plan was to dig up half the I country, I wouldn't have to dig if you could simply manage to bring me the child. We wouldn't need the child if you hadn't sent a dragon to retrieve the container I spent months and countless ministry favors tracking. You let them board the carriage. My options were limited once I knew it would be inconveniently beyond my reach at that infernal school. Have you not acquired enough power here? I allowed you to tunnel under my family home. Allowed me? You are here only because you are descended from a Keeper and may at some point inadvertently become valuable. We had an agreement. I will share with you the power that I discovered if you locate the stores of magic that are yet to be found. So, unless you want another demonstration of my power, a power that you one day hope to wield, Bring me the child. <laughs> oh my gosh. We don't don't talk right. about that. Oh, we know I have been eating. Of magic. And Ranrock knows about the Keepers. Yes, I caught that too. Professor Rookwood said that you'd understand more once you complete the next trial. Let's Put get you into that second. castle. Oh, they were a nice mushrooms. Any special words you want me to pass on to your mum?
Goblin tracks. They're a step ahead of us. Let's see where they lead. Revelio. I'd seen the car's tower countless times. Never suspected it held the secrets it did. This must be it. The store of magic and the source of Ramrod's power. It looks empty. If they've taken all of it, why are they still here? Ranrock said there's more to be found, and if he's right about that, it may or may not be located here. Wherever it is, we need to find it before they do. Where is that portrait? Professor Rookwood, the goblins and dark wizards who've overrun your castle are digging for stores of magic, and have broken open some sort of container. No. Things are more dire than I could have imagined. If, as you told Percival, a goblin in his vault was wielding a powerful magic, then they have somehow learned. It cannot be. And, sir, they know you were a keeper. Ranrock used the term. This makes no sense. How did... We shall discuss this later. Right now, you must complete the next trial. Just tell me where I need to go. The power you stand to wield must first be fully understood. The trials will ensure that. Power without knowledge is dangerous indeed. In the wrong hands, we will simply have to outwit Ranrock. And my unfortunate namesake. Very well, Professor. Tell me where I need to go. I shall reveal the path. Professor Fig must leave you now. I would join you if I could. I shall await your arrival in the map chamber.
marks readjusts the archways. Perhaps there's a way forward from the other side of this one. This doesn't make sense. <laughs>
goes so far. To relief. I am curious to hear of Isidore's travels. Do come in. Please, have a seat. Isadora, we are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father... These are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. Isadora. What have you done? I took his pain. This is uncharted magic, Isadora. You can only see what has been sealed in the jar, and we do not know what power that may hold. But the traces of that magic are different from what I've seen before. Thank you. It is good to see you again. Professor Rookwood told me about what happened at Rookwood Castle. In light of the dire circumstances in which we find ourselves, it is most fortunate that someone so competent is following this path. Thank you, Professor. 
I shall keep this second artifact safe, as you've advised. Good. Are you ready to move on? What was the glowing stand that Isadora pulled from her father's chest? It was... pain. You will understand more about her actions as you complete the trials. I'm ready for whatever comes next. In that case, introductions are in order. Allow me to introduce former Hogwarts headmistress, Neve Fitzgerald. How do you do? I must say that I was not entirely surprised to learn that a student had been completing the trials. I've always believed Hogwarts students capable of anything they set their minds to. Thank you, Professor. It's a pleasure to meet you as well. I am certain that you are more than capable of completing my trial. However, I must first, how shall I say, prepare the location of your next trial. We trust your judgment, Professor Fitzgerald. You should know better than anyone how to manage the inconvenience of, well... A vainglorious and exasperating headmaster? Indeed I should. I shall confirm that everything is in order immediately. Of course. Professor Fitzgerald needs some time to clear the way forward. Until then, you should continue to hone your magic. If you learn more about Ranrock and Victor Rookwood's activities in the meantime, please let us know. Very well, Professor. I know, I know. Continue to hone my magic. You do learn quickly. Hopefully you will soon hear from Lodgok as well. And we shall learn how he fared with the helmet you retrieved. Well done today, as always. We shall speak again soon. Sir, we've not took a thing. Hand them back. There's nothing to give, sir. It was only the one. Uh, that's all of them, sir. Honestly, I swear. How many times are you pair going to keep pilfering my shop? I swear it was just those ones, we sir. Promise, sir, we'd never take Hufflepuff more than those. Hufflepuff stealing? I tell you this, they'll not appreciate your antics in Azkaban. You just wait till I see your mother. <laughs> Hello, Deke. You wanted to talk to me? Indeed. Uh, Deke thought you might want to learn how to build a breeding pen uh, so that you can breed beasts. That sounds a very good idea. Rescuing and breeding beasts go hand in hand. Uh, young beasts are particularly vulnerable to poachers. Breeding beasts here in the room will allow us to keep the younger ones safe. I see. What do I need to do? First, bring a pair of beasts to the room. One male, one female. Deke suggests rescuing Thestrals, as they're at great risk from poachers. Hmm. Noble creatures, but their relationship with death gives them a bad reputation. They're prized by poachers for their tail hairs. I've Sad. seen Thestrals before. But where would I find a pair of them nearby? Deke has seen some wild pestrels not too far from the Hogwarts grounds. Then you'll need to purchase a spellcraft for the pen from tomes and scrolls and gather the materials it requires. Once Thank you've you for the hug, the Thomas. I'm and giving you a hug back. You have the spellcraft. Mentally. You come and find Deke. <laughs> I'm going to do this. Thank you. That worked easier than Levio, so. <laughs> there, there. I'm not going to hurt you. But now I need a girl. <gasps> a girl. Glacier. Yes! <laughs> I'll look after you. 
I've rescued the Thestrals and bought the spellcraft for the pen. Excellent. Now, to breed your Thestrals, simply release them into the same vivarium in which you conjure the pen. Then use the pen to start the process. Come and see Deke when you're finished. I shall. I wonder where I should conjure their pen. Deke never like grows tired of, of the room surprises. We now have the perfect place for those for testrels. Please let Deke know once you've bred them. Okay, I want to go and get the Thestral from in here first because he's all lonely. Settle yourself. I mean you no harm. <laughs> <laughs> 